Welcome back everybody, and today we're playing more Minecraft Story Mode Season 2, so let's go ahead and get started. Rah! Feels so good to have you back. Thank you so much for your help. I know it got a little weird back there, I appreciate you still helping me anyway. Hey, it's all in the past, Petra. Just happy to reunite you with your favorite deadly weapon. Oh, and it feels so good. What is that? Stop that. Or those. Well, that's a lot of creepers. And they're charged? That should be impossible. Tell them that. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Cheap sword. I got you covered, Jesse. <laughs> so good to have you back. No, you don't! Oh, that would have been dumb if it wasn't so awesome! Oh, come on. We need to get this thing covered up again. gonna get this to hold. That heck mouth blew right through the ground. First your prismarine gauntlet, then that prismarine pit spitting out creepers. We need to get to Jack's fast. Yeah, I hope this treasure hunter knows as much as you say he does. He does. He's gotta. Come on, I'll show you the way. Welcome to Bad Luck Alley. Wow, I didn't even know people hung out down here at night. Well, yeah, it's the cool part. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, you know, these are the people who like to live off the grid, outside the rules. And you're kind of the boss. It's just the way the world works. That's like the trade-off when you're in charge. You know that. Well, I really appreciate you showing me. I know this is like your thing or whatever, and it's nice of you to share. <laughs> you are such a cornball, but no problem. Should be somewhere down here, I think. Wait, have you never been here before? You said you knew a guy. Okay, not know him, know him, I know of him. Okay, fine. He's a legend, all right? He was once one of the greatest treasure hunters in the whole world. And he's kind of a hero of mine. What should I say? What should I do? I can't believe I'm about to meet Jack. But what if he invites me to go adventuring with him? Well, if I can offer some advice, best thing to do around your heroes is just act like yourself. Otherwise, it's weird for everyone. Be myself. Got it? Got it. Jack and Nerm's Adventure Emporium. Yup, that's our place. Man, I've always wanted an excuse to come here.
Spider Peak Mountain? The Ice Crags of Doom? It's just like I told you! Jack might be the best adventurer in town. This stuff is from all over the world. See, Petra? Beacon Town has some pretty cool stuff too, huh? Oh, uh, well, I mean, what's cool about all of this is that it isn't from Beacon Town, though. Uh, but you've got a good point. This is a, a big win for Beacon Town. <clears throat> Welcome to Jack and Nerm's Adventure Emporium. Oh my gosh, it's him. It's Jack. Sorry, I'm, uh, I'm a big fan. You push the button. Very, very brave. I mean, I don't know how brave it was. I was just doing what the sign said. <laughs> there are lots of signs in the world. Not everyone's brave enough to follow them. <sighs> the warriors of the Whispering Mountain call me the Stab Walker. The Air Titans of the East call me he who slashes like thunder. But you may call me... Jack. So cool! I have lots of names, too. The, the people of Sky City call me the, the Ground Finder. Other people know me as the Wither Slayer. You can call me... Uh, Jesse. <sighs> cool names. So, what can I do for you today? Desert Temple? Woodland Mansion? I Whoa! Yeah, that's what we're here about. <coughs> uh, wow, huh? Crazy glove you got there. Not that I've ever seen one before. Uh, looks real crazy, though. Crazy stuff. Never seen it before? That's not the way I heard it. Petra here said you know more about this stuff than anybody. Yeah, come on, Jack. I... that is, um... Found it on top of a creepy bottomless pit, right? Spitting out monsters. Yeah, and it had a slot with, like, a weird symbol. <sighs> you should have never picked up that gauntlet. It's not for us mortals to tamper with. Wow, I'll be sure to remember that the next time I see a mysterious prismarine gauntlet. That sass won't fix the pit any faster, you know. That pit, it's as deadly as they come. And that symbol you saw was the symbol of the structure block. Legend says it was a mighty tool that could grow civilizations like seeds, create cities in the blink of an eye. You need one of those to close your pit. So where can I get one of these structure blocks? Petra thought maybe an ocean monument because of the prismarine? Oh, it's an ocean monument, all right. The villagers of Mushroom Archipelago call it the Sea Temple. Hmm. No, no. No problem. Guys, this is Nurm, my other half. Just as a side note, when I saw the trailers, I was hoping Nurm's voice would be from Dan Lloyd, here's just a small clip. Free Wiffy! Mmm, Wiffy. And it's just a bit disappointing that it's just a bunch of hmms from the uh, testificate noises. So, that's just an interesting side note. Anyway, back to the game. He's the genius behind all of our fine maps. Nerm, this is Jesse and Petra. Hmm. Hi. Oh, hi. I was just about to tell these two that I can't help them. What? I love your early work. Witherstorm, Old Builders, awesome. But as a purveyor of fine maps and adventures, your death would be terrible for business. But... Sorry. I just can't. Hmm. 
Jack, come on, do I really need to list off all the amazing things we've done to prove that we're tough enough to handle this? We can take anything you throw at us. <sighs> Let me show you something. It's like I said before. The world's a lot bigger than you think it is, Jesse. Yes, the empty square is where we need to go. Yep. And it's missing because... I, uh, kind of burned it. I threw it into a volcano, okay? What? Why? You didn't need that kind of danger anyway, all right? I swore I wouldn't take anyone else to that temple ever again. I refuse to let it take any more lives. Hmm. <sighs> Shut up, Nurm. What? Oh, I see what's going on here. You're scared. No. I'm the one the Apex Hunters of the Sergeo Pass call Fearless Dagger. I don't do scared. I found a gauntlet just like that once. Teamed up with my friends Voss and Sammy to follow its trail. Neither of them made it out alive. Hence, uh, you know... Lava, map, volcano, you remember what I was saying, anyway. But burning the map couldn't erase the horrible memories. And thanks to the curse of my perfect sense of direction, I couldn't forget the location of that temple if I tried. So, if you're the only one who knows where it is... Yep, without me, you never get into that sea temple. That knowledge is... my curse. Hmm. Jack, I get that you're haunted by horrible memories, but that's no reason to sit around moping. What'd you say? It's time to go get us some treasure and help you face your demons. Yeah! Well, that sounds to me like a challenge. And no one, and I mean no one, challenges the Velvet Tornado, me, and gets away with it. Yeah? Nerm, time to get our adventuring things. Mm. Jesse, it's perfect. Structure block, sea temple. I know, it's amazing. It's almost too good to be true. Ah, uh, yes! And Jack, man, he is awesome, right? Ah, uh, I can't believe it! I'm going on an adventure with Jack. Eee! Let's just hope he's as good as he says he is. He's a little... blustery, but I get a good vibe off him. I can't wait to see him in action. Nerm, I told you, it's not the admin. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, fine. What did he say? Nothing. Villager stuff. Nerm here? Wants to make a new map of this place. Uh, what with the uh, whole lava volcano incident. What's got you so excited about this one? Uh, I'll explain on the way. So that means we're off to the Sea Temple? Don't you think you're looking a little squishy for that? Seriously? I mean, you're wearing a vest. The vest of five fists. Gifted to me by the singing clerics of Port. Okay, geez, I get it. It's a cool vest. Come on, I just need to make a quick pit stop and I can show you some real armor. Oh, Jesse, I'm so glad you're here. Hey, Radar. There is a lot going on. Someone still needs to finalize the ideas for the Founding Day banners. The cake-baking team can't agree on what color to make the front of their shop. 
The Woolmakers Guild isn't super happy about their booth being next to the Firework Radar. Union. Understandable. The delegate from Boomtown left word that she wanted to make a speech at the parade. Very odd. Blue hair smells like sulfur. Speaking of which, you should probably work on your founding day keynote address. Oh, and rehearse it! Radar! Why my factor in- ah, Sorry, got in the zone there. Uh, what's up, boss? I see you brought friends. And a new accessory? Short version, the town's in danger. I stopped it for now, but I think this can help me fix it permanently. I'll be gone for a little bit. G gone? But, Jesse, what about Beacon Town? Founding day is right around the corner, and if it's really in, in, in danger, who will protect everyone? There's no telling what could happen! Why don't you try leading them, pal? What? Me? That's... this is... Try not to explode. Ah! Jesse, I won't let you down. I know you won't. Good luck, boss. Beacon Town will be waiting for you when you get back. Sure. Ha! Um, goodbye. Oh. <laughs> you said it. Can't believe that's your assistant. He's more wound up than a pack of parrots with a jukebox. Or a creeper in a herd of cats. Or a squid in a, I don't know, a box. Or si anyway, he's real nervous is what I'm saying. He's a little nuts, but his heart's in the right place. <clears throat> if you say so. So, where's this armor of yours? Oh, wow. You got some pretty cool stuff here. Stuff I've never... Uh, probably only seen, you know, once or twice. Not as cool as my stuff, obviously, but uh, you're well on your way. Definitely on your way to becoming a big hero like me. Not as big, of course, but, uh, you know, a real, a real great swing. Best part is, there's always another adventure on the horizon. Yeah, like a sea temple. Yeah, okay, not exactly what I meant, but sure. Hey, wait, is this not where you keep your armor anymore? Yeah, I'm not seeing any armor. No, no, I just had Olivia install a little upgrade while she was here. need some TNT. Magnus would be proud. Now that's more like it. Agreed. Hey, uh, can you just give me and Jesse a minute? Huh? Oh. Listen, with the heck mouth and everything, I feel like I didn't get to properly apologize. For all the stuff with my sword, Champion City, so I'm sorry. You won't hear it again, so don't get used to it. I'll totally deny everything later. I appreciate it. I mean, it's pretty big of you. Hey, look, I really meant it. Ah, it really is big of me, isn't it? Okay, now with that sappy stuff out of the way, let's go find us a sea temple. Jack, Nurm, you guys ready to go? Always. So where are we going exactly? It's time to chart a course for Doom Sea. Oh, shut up, Nurm. It's an awesome name.
I slept on an enormous pile of diamonds that night. Enormous? Oh, I can only imagine! <sighs> oh, yeah. Pretty typical day for me. You'll see. After this, I'll take you to this amazing woodland mansion I found. Yeah, let's make that happen. It's really far from here. I love it. It's almost certain death. Hey, that sounds really cool. I can't wait either. Uh, yeah, sure, of course. All right, before we go down there, I feel I should give you one last warning. The rules as you know them, how the world works, those don't always apply in this temple. Mm. Hey, what? Some people believe it's because this temple was made by the admin. The what? <sighs> Supposedly he's some all-powerful ancient person. Built the world, I don't know. But the legend of the admin is just that. A legend. A story. Bunch of superstitious malarkey, frankly. I've been to the swamps of Funja and back, and that's still one of the more ridiculous things I've ever heard. So, this temple, it's dangerous then? You don't have any sponge in your ears, do you? Yeah, this place is super dangerous. Uh, we used this island as our staging area last time we were here. How can you be so sure it's the same one? Uh, perfect internal compass. The... The sea temple is directly below us. It's like I can feel it. Hey, uh, how exactly are we going to breathe? I knew a guy that taught me how to hold my breath for ten minutes. I mean, that's impressive, but... Picked up these enchanted helmets from the deep dwellers of Honbar Kavas. Time to suit up and roll out. Temples that way. How? Compass. Right. Oh, that's so cool. Thank you. 
Now, if we're sure that we have all our limbs, how about we find that structure block? Forgot they did that. Okay, that's not normal. Oh man, those Pretty things are creepy. Right, Petra? If you look closely, carvings on this prismarine aren't like anywhere else in the world. Really? Yep. Completely unique. No one's quite sure why. But you'll never have an experience like this. I, uh, I'm gonna need a sec, just to check my enchantments. Yeah, gotta make sure they're all there. Okay. Well, I'm gonna scout ahead. <sighs> huh? What's wrong? Yeah, uh, nothing, nothing. Must hit a patch of soul sand or something. Oh, whoa, it's uh, got me, like, um, uh, frozen in place. I don't care if you're swimming through a potion of slowness. Move your feet, Jack. You're being dumb. What? Yeah, you're right. I'm better than this. I am better than this. Guys, hey, I found something. Uh, be right there. Hey, uh, let's, uh, just keep this between you and me, huh, amigo? She's a fan. It's nice. Look, you have no idea how it feels to have everyone around you think you're some... Has been. I don't think Petra needs to hear about it. Ah, uh, don't worry, Jack. We all get scared from time to time. Yeah, yeah, I, I guess. Hey, thanks. I found the next door down there, but it needs that glove thingy of yours. What's keeping you guys? Uh, uh, nothing. Absolutely nothing. Let's check it out. Okay, that is cool. Sure. Let's see how cool you think it is when your life is on the line. Inches from the abyss. Ah. I know what I'm talking about, Nerm. Just do what I do, and you'll be fine, all right? Oh, really? I mean, yeah. Yeah, you're the boss. Okay, that's going to do it for today's episode, so like, comment, and subscribe, and ring that subscription bell, and I will see you next time. Bye!